How do airlines test older aircraft for structural fatigue? Let me explain. Every commercial aircraft goes through constant stress, pressurization cycles, turbulence, landings, and over time, metal fatigue starts to build in critical areas. To catch it early, airlines rely on non-destructive testing. One method is ultrasonic inspection, where high-frequency sound waves are used to detect hidden cracks deep inside the structure. But that's not all. Technicians also use eddy current testing to find surface cracks in aluminum skin and lap joints, even ones smaller than a grain of rice. However, the most crucial checks happen during heavy maintenance, often called a D-check. The entire aircraft is stripped down, sometimes for over a month, and examined inch by inch. In some cases, engineers even compare current test results to historical stress maps based on how the specific aircraft has been flown. Fatigue builds differently depending on route type, turbulence exposure, and even how hard the landings were. If cracks are found, depending on their size and location, they can either be repaired or trigger a part replacement.